the show where your dollars make sense and there's always fun and tips and gossip and celebrity excitement. Today we have Grammy nominee and singing sensation Laura Branigan, and I think that's great. service department, the inside lowdown are where the royal shop and what they buy. Never mind shop, it's what they buy, those richies. Plus, of course, we have some great deals and some great products. So, Deborah Wilson, tell us what we can shop for today. It would be my pleasure. Listen, you guys, get set to get down, dance, and enjoy, because Laura Branigan is back, and we're offering for the first time ever, as a package deal, her new CD, Over My Heart, which has a great duet with Michael Bolton, and her classic debut CD, Branigan, which includes the mega hit, Gloria. <laughs> Pretty, pretty, pretty. That's a clip of my next guest. She is a Grammy-nominated recording artist who struck gold with the first song she ever released. It became the dance anthem of the disco era, a simple song called Gloria. Remember that? Today she is here to perform her new single and also to present a two-part timeless music collection. Please welcome Laura Branigan. <laughs> doing in between albums in between albums yeah, I know there were well, 12 been, in the middle yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know that I've been uh, touring a lot since the last right. album and married when did you get married uh, seven years ago okay and working out working out okay oh, working out yeah working out too working and out. it's working out does he tour with you no he doesn't so that's sometimes only the good places yeah where is home <laughs> New York New York so when is, what does he consider a good place Africa <laughs> yeah that's a good place yes. yeah right <laughs> where do you go how much part of the year do you spend going around touring? I would say um, uh, three quarters, maybe maybe half the year. It's a long, long But I don't go out straight. I go out and come back. I go out for, for a month and then come back for a couple of weeks because, you know, I have a big voice and a big range and my show is, is long and it's just me, so I have to come back and rest. How do you watch your voice? I know as a comedian, even if I'm rasping, you know, I can still get the joke out. Right. As long as I can say, she was so fat, that it's okay. But you have but, to support it, right? Yeah, but what about you? What happens? You always watch, you wake up in the morning and go, I gotta be careful today, I can't talk. Oh, absolutely. I, like, this morning, <laughs> I knew I was singing this afternoon, so as soon as I woke up, I'd go, ah! You yeah, know, I start, yeah. I start immediately, ah! And I also, I have a, uh, I had a beautiful, vocal coach, Carlo Minotti, who just passed away. He was this old eccentric Italian man. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. And uh, I work out with him five days a week. So they had to find a new coach. Yeah, now I do. I haven't found one. I haven't looked. Tell me about, now, this is the first. That's the first. first um, and we have a clip. Are you ready to see yourself? Oh, no. Yeah, I know. You take a look. Where, where can we show her? There we are. Up, up there. Cute. But you look svelte now. Yeah. yeah but, well, that's what happens. You get successful, you put yourself together. Yeah, lose weight when you see yourself on TV. It's oh, like, oh, no. <laughs> Who was Gloria? Was she anybody? Gloria was, uh, well, the song was originally an Italian song. Right. Um, recorded by Umberto Tozzi in Italy. It was a big hit. And my producer at the time was from Europe, brought me the song. And we, it, was a, it was a love song, very soft. And we completely changed it. We wrote the lyrics and gave it an American kick. I think right. Gloria wasn't anyone I knew, but it was like, it was representative of what was happening in the 80s when everyone was just going, wow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what about now? You get a lot of songs given to you that others, uh, well, there's a song Dolly wanted very much and you got it, which was? I know. Um, it's been, um, 
How, how can I help you to say goodbye? Yeah, yeah, it's a beautiful song. It's so sad. Why do you, you do a lot of sad songs? Yeah. Is your life, what are you drawing? Has your life been sad or I hope I, not? Well, it has been. You know, I had a, I had a rough time growing up and um, I think I drew, drew a lot off that. And I've had a lot of unrequited loves. Yeah. And so, and I think also that um, as far as uh, music goes, the most powerful emotion is pain. Yes. You know, yes. and and I think that people, everybody, loves to be uh, have something they can relate to when they go through pain, and and that's the kind of songs I love. So. Now tell me what's on the second album. Okay. The first album is your original album, which includes obviously Gloria, right? Yes. Now, what did you put onto the second album? We're giving these two albums together. They come in a package, either the CD or the cassette. What's going on in the second one, which is called Over My Heart, which looks, the cover is so beautiful. Thank you. The second one is, it, this album I really chose songs that I loved. I absolutely loved. Um, Michael Bolton wrote me a song. We didn't do a duet on it. He wrote me a song. He wrote me the single. Isn't that great? Yeah. Isn't that kid you would say, oh yeah, Michael Bolton wrote me a song. <laughs> he also wrote How Am I Supposed to Live Without You, which I had a hit with. Yeah. Oh, so, so that's where your relationship yeah. came from. So um, I was thrilled. And it's this song, this is a good album to split your wrist by. <laughs> yeah. No, it was a good album. <laughs> no, I mean, if you're really sad. It's a, a great album where you've been through a big romance. Yes. And you just want to know that others have gone through it right. and you can identify with That's it. That's it. It's, and everybody's got that big romance yeah. somewhere. Aren't you sorry oh, now, God. David Feinerson? So anyhow, <laughs> <laughs> will you sing us a song from the I album? I will. Okay. And you have to walk over there. We have okay. a whole big set for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, from her new album, Over My Heart, please welcome Laura Branigan. <laughs> For the first time in such a long time I've been feeling there's some reason to hold on through the night And for the first time since you broke this heart of mine I find myself believing it's really gonna be Believed in every word you said I still love you But my heart won't take the chance All the pain I've left behind me Might be waiting for me up ahead Just remember it was you who walked out of my life Oh, you don't know what I've been
Number N145 and priced at just $23.95. And the two cassette set is item number N146 and priced at just $15.95.